x squared, 4x, and 3. And once again, if I'm a little child, I'm learning addition facts. Well, what do I need? I need another x. And I need three more green ones. In this case, I'm going to use these. But the child could have gotten out three more green ones to make a 6. Now, former rectangle count sizes. So if I put this here and put the rest of these on top, uh-oh, they're not going to fit. And you have to let the child discover this for himself. But now I've made a rectangle. x squared, 5x and 6. And we can learn all about factoring and all about how we can break up numbers. We can learn a lot more than just factoring in algebra by doing factoring in algebra. Can I count the sides? x plus 1, 2. x plus 1, 2, 3. Just counting the edges, I have x plus 2 and x plus 3. I've seen students in near tears because they had a difficult time using FOIL and other techniques and algorithms and rules and it's this easy. Simply form a rectangle, count the sides. And once again, because we only have an hour here, I can't get into negative coefficients and so forth, but just you can see that we can teach the mathematics using these blocks very simply and easily.